We have the latest on Hacienda Healthcare. The Phoenix facility where an incapacitated woman was raped and gave birth last year has been granted a state license to operate again. The Arizona Department of Health Services approved the license last week. It is valid for uh, 11 months, we're told. The legislature revoked Hacienda Healthcare's license in the wake of the female patient's sexual assault. Right now, the facility is under state oversight as part of an effort to overhaul its operation, policies, and procedures. Authorities say Hacienda staff had no idea the 29-year-old woman was pregnant until she gave birth in December. The victim's caregiver, 37-year-old Nathan Sutherland, has pleaded not guilty to raping her. He's being held in Maricopa County Jail on a half-million-dollar cash bond only.